What's up guys? So today I will show you how to get QCAP Pro um, using your um, computer to install QCAP Pro on your iPhone or iPad devices. So what you will need is iTunes. So there's two versions for iTunes on the Windows the Windows 10 computers. So there's one for uh, the Microsoft Store, and I think uh, the 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 website version of the iTunes is is better. So I think um, I recommend uh, downloading the the um, you know the website one. Okay. So yeah, once you done that. Uh, what you want to do is just uh, download side load right here so to download that I'll also link on the description uh, this one here. so just scroll down uh, you'll see download side load Lee and then yeah something like this so it will ask you to download a 64-bit or a 32-bit so uh, I want you to check that on your computer if you have a 32-bit or 64-bit compu computer if you don't know so what you want to do here is go ahead to your file explorer so right here then what you want to do is right click on this PC and then you want to press properties and then you'll sh you should see here the system type is 64 bit operating system okay so if you have the 64 bit one you want to download this if you have a 30 32 bit version of your computer uh, download this one okay so um, once you've done all of that process uh, also download QCAD Pro on the, uh, the the file the EPUB version so so yeah, just go ahead and download it so it's in my desktop already uh, so what you want to do once you installed side load you want to just open it So as you can see, this is how it looks like. It's like CD at Impactor if you, um, you know, tried doing this before. So what you want to do first is go ahead and type in your email address. That is your Apple account. Okay. So now once you've done that, go ahead and drag your QCAP profile in here and then once you've done that uh, you want to plug in your iPhone or iPad devices there we go you heard the the sound so we're gonna go ahead just press start you don't have to worry about these stuff just press start okay or you can also press the the little button here to check um, you know it's working so just signing now th this depends on your um, computer you're using uh, if you have the um, you know a low-end computer this might be slower to download okay so it's just installing 15% Also, you'll uh, make sure you trust. Make sure you want to trust your uh, computer before you actually do this. Okay, don't forget that. Okay, so you can see done. So when once it says done, you want to go ahead to your iPad or iPhone. 
Alright guys, so I'm in my iPad, so as you can see I got QCAP Pro. Now as you can see it works perfectly fine. Now what you want to do first if it doesn't work for you, you will have to verify first, okay? Um you wanna go to your settings and then make sure you wanna go ahead to your general, okay? Just scroll down and you will find general. Okay, and then you just want to go, you want to scroll down again, and you will find the profiles and device management. You want to press on it, and then right here, you should see your email address, your um, uh, iTunes email. So, you want to click on it, and then there should be a uh, trust button uh, a blue one not the, the delete app since I already done it um, it says delete app so since that's verified now I could run QCAT Pro okay as you can see works perfectly fine there you go create uh, frame rate 60 um, yeah, let's uh, hit done. So here's the stuff. I just press video, uh, hello, access, and uh, let's go ahead and uh, choose. Okay, so if you want to stretch it out, go ahead here. So you're just go ahead and stretch out your iPad. Okay, so that's pretty much how you do it. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.